Hi, this is a quick tutorial about exporting light maps from SketchUp. I've got a simple uh, scene here um, and it's got a few light sources already set up. Um, I've got a, a little sort of spotlight here. If I just, um, it's a pretty bright spotlight that's going to be shining on the wall. If I just change that color. Um, Okay, let's just change it to uh, a sort of hot pink colour. Um, I've also got some strip lights here on the wall. Um, and in this other sort of adjoining room, I've got um, a large emitter, which is meant to be like um, daylight shining through closes and we're just going to generate the light maps um, and then we'll um, do the export. Um, I'm going to export as Autodesk FBX files um, and I'll show them being imported straight into Unity. Okay so the lighting's done. You can see we've got some nice lighting from the uh, sort of daylight uh, here coming in and also we've got this sort of purpling purple light over in the corner and these these strip lights here um, I've also got this car with a crazy light underneath um, so if I want to export this now um, I've got all my lighting set up now um, I can just bring up the export dialog um, I've got swap Y and Z checked because SketchUp has the Z axis uh, as up, whereas Unity um, doesn't. Um, and I'm going to just uh, click export model and go to a folder in my Unity uh, assets um, folder and just save. Okay, now if I go over to Unity uh, it's picked up the addition of those files uh, and it's just importing it now. So it's imported. Um, now here it is here. Now the thing is that all the materials were automatically assigned so there's no need to um, manually assign the light maps. They've all been assigned automatically by script. Um, and if I get my first person controller and just focus on that and then I can bring in, there we go. So that's um, exactly the same model imported into uh, and, and uh, immediately visible in Unity with all the light maps. Um, I can actually activate this first person controller uh, in the game view. Um, there we go. So this is in the game view and we can see all our nice light mapping. Um, the key thing to remember is to, um, uh, on the settings, import settings, is to have one material for every material in the scene to ensure that you get um, all the light mapping materials correct. Um, that's, that's it. Thank you.